Hello, um, welcome and thank you very much that you are trying to help me out. I'm a new Blender user so I lack of experience and I just was not able to find any solution for this problem. It's about baking normal maps and what I've learned so far is that you have to use a high quality image, 32-bit float, that you have to use cycles and yes, um, of course, don't forget to set uh, the image to non-color space. And here we have it. There are duplicates, two cubes of the same version, but you will see differences between them. Because I am suspicious what causes this problem. It's all about sharp edges or jagged edges that appear uh, on the cube where they should not be. So if you look at this part of the cube here. It's n this part is clean, this part is clean, this part has it. You can see it looks weird here. And if you go further down, sometimes it also looks like a pinched line or so. It looks a little bit strange. If I go now to the next one here, you can see even up here he has this pinched line in this, this area. So, for comparisons, here it is not, here it is clean, and here we have it. Looks ugly. So, what's the difference? I've baked them for both cubes with exact the same settings, no differences. The di only difference is I have rearranged the UV seams that I've used for the unwrapping. So if I check this cube, do we notice that up here where the line appears there is an UV seam and on this one where it is clean and looks good there is no UV seam. So mark seam seems to have some impact on that and I don't understand that What's going on there? Whoa, whoa. Whoa, what's that? Do I have anything selected? No. Hmm. Weird. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. And um, yes. And you can see the, the effect very good here on the bottom of the cube. I haven't sculpted anything in that part of the high polygon mesh, so it remains basically unchanged. And you can see it as well here at this corner, here is an UV seam running along, and here in this area there's no. And if I turn it off, you can clearly see that here in this area that is supposed to be smooth, just like here on this part here, on this part, here you can see that lines. And yeah, it is it is it is a little bit, little bit weird. I don't understand why this is happening, what's causing this, and how to get rid of this. <sighs> yes, any ideas, any suggestions, what can I do? I um, will give you the blend file and you can check it out for yourself. It's a basic, very basic structure and baking textures should be something very basic, shouldn't it be? So what is uh, the secret um, that I'm failing to find to make the right adjustments. Maybe you can be of help. I would be thankful for that. Thank you very much and have a nice day.